Hello world and welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. This is Wogs. When we last left off, uh, we'd done another live stream and so we are a bit further ahead again. Um, I also went ahead and did some things off stream uh, just because it was a lot of grinding and more tedious stuff. Um, I've got these tables now. I've got the large ones. Um, so I think these are the, uh, yeah, these are the flux seeds so I can do that, um, that quest. Got all these going for the Merlin trials. And uh, I found some um, gear that is unidentified. And so we're going to identify it. Let's look at it. Oh, that's all it took. Whoa. Okay. I thought it was going to be a lot more than that. All right, let's see. So one of them was this. Ooh, it's got a thing on it. Increased damage by all plants. I don't care, but that is fine. And increased damage dealt to cursed targets. Sweet. What the? Okay. Interesting. Oh, also, we got this freaking sick looking handle for the wand. Isn't that awesome? Definitely keeping that. I don't really, I don't really care for these other ones. These are kind of weird looking. I mean, this one's not terrible. This one I'm not into at all, but this one just looks sick. All right, so we just got a crap load of really nice stuff right there, so um, I could probably go sell that. However, want to look at our quests right now. Okay, so reach level 12, learn Depulso from Professor Sharp. But that's locked. Well, I need to acquire and use the Focus Potion and then acquire Maxima and Endurance. Endurus and use them both. Maxima... Endurus, focus. Can I make any of those? Okay, so I can just purchase these from J. Pippins. Okay, well, let's go do that, I guess. All right, so I'm going to go and do all these little side quest things real quick. Uh, cast a pulse on an enemy. So, okay, so I need to go and fly and do these towers. Okay, let me go do this real quick. So I mentioned this at the end of last stream, um, but I don't think I did here. The I'm going to change um, a little bit of how I make these episodes because I've been putting out um, different posts on my channel. If you guys want to go to the community tab on my channel, you'll see those posts um, asking what games you want to see and whatnot. But also, one of the questions was um, what... What duration of videos do you like? Do you like 15 minutes or less or 30 minutes or more? And the majority of you said 15 or less. So I'm going to try to cut these videos down to be about 15 minutes or less or maximum 20. Um, but we'll see. Focus. Then... Maxima. Yeah. Excellent. There we go. All right. So that's done there. Oh my gosh. Look at me. Holy crap. That is a crazy looking effect. That's dope looking. Please open. You be sure to stop by soon. So one of the other things that I learned was that you can use this spell and it lets you open these and it's 500 a piece now it does that and I always feel bad because I'm like did I just kill that thing or whatever because it whines like a dog but uh I don't know I don't know what you just said to me but okay all right so let's get this spell well done. done. Have you been reporting back, Professor? Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say, and you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. Oh dear.
And there we go. Akio. Oh wow. That's cool. Very good. I recommend practicing your new spell as much as possible. Leviosa. Perhaps before you leave here. Sure. Do, do this one. We'll put it there. Arrest moment. That's it. Keep it up. That's cool. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few pots. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice it. Lady, you gotta learn how uh, so people talk these days. Us. Just look at that. You're a natural. When Professor Sharp is so How are your assignments coming along? The good, the good, the good. Go sit down and I'll tell you about them. I'll tell you about my ventures. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. You've got it now. Good. Perhaps best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Also. Well done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spell casting. Yeah. Am for sure. All right, cool. All right, so we got that done. Now we can do this quest finally. We need to do Descendo. Cast a Pulso on a Levitated Enemy. Let's go do that real quick, actually. All right, so we'll go in here real quick. Throw somebody up in the air. Throw them away like some trash that they probably are. And then we'll get back to the other, the other stuffs. You can feed a beast, or it can feed you, if you get my meaning. You're the little sod that saved Treadwell. Slippery to the Avoiding our problems. I've seen Billy Wings before, Sting. Stop sleeping around like a fool! Levioso! Depulsa! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> like it was nothing. Ironically, I didn't see ahead of time how bored I'd be in divination class. Hello, all. It's quite the effort to get into the class.
Is it, I I don't remember seeing her or taking this class before. Is it just are they just kind of saying that? Did you just make him realize that? Or did you do whatever it was that he needed? I don't remember her at all. Or this class. Come on, Everett. Hey, Natty. I hope those assignments... I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Renoi. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious, based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come. What do you see in your own future? Hmm. I mean, definitely danger. I can't get rid of this feeling of a coming... danger. I see. Know that such omens are not damning if they can at least prepare us. And you are preparing yourself even now. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Channel your Thanks. magic towards your targets. You have it. Now, why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? Okay, so we can do this. We can throw you up and then we can Excellent. throw you down. I think you have it. <laughs> At some point, you Oof. must stop preparing and put your newly honed skills to the test outside of the classroom. I will. I just wanted to smash his face real quick. Hello there. Nice to see you. Yeah, you too. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. He's a friend. How can you trust a goblin? What the f- It seems as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But... He recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him, about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. Friendship between wizards and goblins is rare enough, but between those two, they each want something the other has. I can guarantee it. That said, 
I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. You seemed unfazed by Rookwood and Harlow the other day. They don't scare you. They're bullies. Plain and simple. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly won't tolerate them going after my friends. Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. Thank you, Serona. If you find Lord Gog, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. Will do. Thanks for the help. All right, let's see. Come on, walk through the door, dude. I don't get why some games, like, make you walk super slow through the doors. I don't know if it's some sort of, like, loading thing or... Hello. Good to see you outside the castle. You too, Amit. <laughs> Welcome to the Ogs Head. Any empty seat is yours. Whoa, I just realized that freaking... The actual hogshead. Hello, Lord Cock. Sorona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. What are you doing? It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Hmm. Sorona trusts me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Sorona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need and meet me near the witch's tomb. Yeah, I didn't want to say that it sounds like a trap because I don't want to give any reason for like mistrust or anything. That wand is broken. What happened? What happened? I'm ready. Good. There's no time to lose.